Hi everyone, welcome to Evie's Toy House and today is a really exciting day because we got two brand new dolls from Miraculous Ladybug. So we have Marinette and Chloe wearing brand new outfits and don't they look adorable? So we do have already the two uh, Marinette and Chloe dolls wearing their uh, traditional um, outfits from the show. So I'm thinking these are probably outfits that we will see in season two of the show. So let me show you. Here is Marinette. So back here is the back of the box and here is Marinette looking super cute in her polka dot pink dress. And over here we have Chloe. And take a look at that. She looks really, really cute. I didn't notice here that her hair seems like uh, it's colored differently. Instead of blonde, she is now a brunette. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? So, um, so we're going to be adding her to the full line of dolls that we have here. I kind of wish that instead of making a brand new Marinette and Chloe doll in different outfits, that they would give us uh, different dolls like uh, Alia or maybe uh, Julika and some of the other characters. But this is what we have, so let's open them up and take a closer look. Alright, so here is Marinette out of her box and I really like her. Look at her, she's really cute. So her hair is not show accurate at all. She has long hair instead of short and it is kind of tied back on the top here instead of in pigtails. So back here it's blue and as you can see it's kind of tied back here um, halfway up here. Her face is um, not very show accurate either, but I think it's actually really cute. She has um, big blue eyes, some blush, and a really nice uh, cute pink lips. And her outfit is a pink polka dot outfit. It is a halter top, so as you can see here, it is um, fastened with velcro up here on the top and also down her waist. And she has a black belt and black lace trim. That is a very nice detail. She's also wearing a red necklace. This looks like um, beads, so a red beaded necklace. And a pair of red shoes. <laughs> These shoes, I think, are a little bit um, funny looking. <laughs> they're platforms, they're uh, super platforms. So they're very thick on the front and thick on the side here. And I think if you cut off the heels, it'll look like those um, brand new, really popular uh, heelless shoes that, that are out right now. <laughs> and she has little big red bows on top of them. She also comes with a red purse, which does not open at all. So this is just a solid block of um, a rubber here. So she can just carry this. There we go. All right, next we have Chloe. So Chloe, I think her face is a lot more show accurate. To me, just by looking at the doll, I can kind of tell this is Chloe. So I really like the way her face is designed. She has just that <laughs> Chloe look. So um, what's different about this doll is that she has this pink uh, highlight a streak going down here, which is different. I have not seen it in the show, um, but hopefully maybe this is something that will show up in season two. In fact, here is her hair. I am not really liking the way her hair is cut. It looks really choppy. Um, I wish, I, I think it's supposed to look layered, but um, the way it turned out is it just looks kind of mangled. <laughs> I think if they had just made it flat uh, or cut straight across, it would have been, a, a, it would have a better effect. But uh, the way it looks now, I think you pretty much have to spread it out just so that it looks kind of decent. Otherwise, it looks kind of just like a kid took a scissors to it and just chopped it up. So there's that. Or you can always tie it up in a ponytail. So if you tie it up in the ponytail, it'll actually look okay. So Chloe here also comes with a new dress. She is wearing a really cute dress. This one has a silver top, so it's sparkly silver, and a yellow bottom on here. It's more of a satiny bottom. So back here is where the clasp is. And for her shoes, she is wearing also a similar to Marinette, these kind of very big, um, clunky uh, platform shoes. And she has three little bows on top. 
As far as articulation goes, um, both of these dolls are articulated in multiple points at the elbow, at the wrist, which actually rotates but does not bend, and also at the hips and the knees. So you can pose her in many different uh, poses. And as you can see here, they're actually, um, their skin color is different. So Marinette is more of a pink color and Chloe is more of a beige, uh, more pale beige color, which also matches their face skin tone too. And Chloe also comes with a pink bag. So this one has little bumps on it, um, like a quilted feel to it, which is really nice. And again, these don't open, it's just kind of a solid piece of rubber, kind of like an eraser. Go shopping with these. Alright, so here are my two Marinettes and two Chloe dolls. I think as far as outfits go, I do like the show accurate uh, season one outfits better, maybe because it's um, I'm just used to seeing it and I just really like the detail and the quality of their outfits better than the new summer dresses. As far as hair goes, uh, I, I like this style of hair on Marinette better. If we had to have long hair, I'd rather have it look more uh, flowy and down rather than this kind of a weird pigtail look. But for Chloe, I do like her in her ponytail look better just because her hair doesn't look so choppy in the back. So let me know down below in the comment section what you think of these new dolls and which one of these outfits you like better. The traditional ones or the show accurate ones or these new summer dresses. I've also done reviews of these other dolls so if you have not seen them yet make sure to go and check those out. And if you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!